The SMU Mustangs are moving on to the quarterfinals after a win over UConn here in the first round of the conference tournament. I'm Haley Outen alongside SMU head coach Tim Jankovic. Coach, congratulations on this win. Your team made 10 of 26 shots from three-point land. What allowed your players to get good looks from long range? Well, that's what I'm talking about. That's that's what we <laughs> want to do. That's what we want to do. But I, but I thought today, uh, you know, the big thing was, uh, especially in the first half, I just really liked the way we uh, we shared the ball. We had good ball movement, and we had good concentration. You know, we didn't have many lapses in the first half, and and so we did get a lot of good shots. Sometimes we get good shots and they don't go in, but uh, today was a good day for us. Three players out for the season. One of those is Shake Milton. How has Elijah Landrum stepped in at the point position and handled that pressure as a freshman? Yeah, he's done a terrific job, for, but it's not easy. You know, we're, we're replacing an incredible well, preseason player of the year, and we lost Jure, we lost Everett. We were already shorthanded on because of scholarship numbers with probation. Uh, no team, I, I'm, I'm still trying to find a team that has had more things go against it than this team in the last six weeks. I, I, I'm going to dig through all the history <laughs> books, but but Elijah's done very well um, for me. I'm so happy for our guys. It, really, you just can't even, it's it's worse than people know. Like we, we know the injuries of the people out, but but we haven't publicized the, what's going on inside of guys that are just, you know, they can barely practice. We can barely put a practice together. So it's so it's such a good feeling that they played so well today and, and uh, we, we get to advance. You mentioned adversity, playing with seven scholarship players, some of which are battling, as you mentioned, injuries of their own. How will the mental toughness of this team help you advance, hopefully, in this conference tournament? <laughs> well, we're going to need all of it and more. <laughs> um, you know, I'm, I'm so happy Benny Malagu, who's one of our – was a great – one of the great shooters in the country until five weeks ago when he hurt his wrist. So he hasn't been able to shoot a ball outside of 15 feet for a long time. Happy to see that he could – to, you know, he's starting to get healthy. That's why he played well today. Um, so, so that's another part of maybe a little bit of an uptick. But when we're looking at Cincinnati and we're looking at our roster and, you know, how many guys we have, and it would take a, it will take a, a either perfect or near perfect game. Nothing short of that. Uh, I think they're an amazing team. Uh, obviously, we know them well. We faced them all, basically all of them last year. They're all back. They're good. They're tough. They're old. It'll be, uh, we'll have to play. Just absolutely lights out to beat them. Seven scholarship players and not, you know, a ton of depth on the bench. Going up against Cincinnati, the regular season champions, and with your team playing as many minutes as they are, what is going to put your team in the best position to give yourself a chance tomorrow? Uh, some some great, uh, some great, I don't know, Gatorade, Powerade, whatever it is, uh, you know, refueling for one thing, but you know, it's it's uh, this is this, this is a mountain task. This isn't a small thing. We're gonna be we're gonna be tired. You mentioned we only have seven guys. Some of them are limping, and we're playing. You know, a team that who knows how far they could go. But but you know what? It's it's tournament basketball. It's exciting, and crazier things have happened. Um, but again, I'm not I'm 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 realistic. I know what we're up against, and uh, it will be an incredibly tough challenge for us. All right. Well, good luck tomorrow, Coach. Thank you. Thank you. I'm now joined by SMU forward Ben Emeligu. Ben, congratulations on this win in the first round of the tournament. 23 points, 8 rebounds, one of your best games of the season. I know you've been battling a wrist injury all year long. How has that impacted your ability to shoot the ball? Uh, it most definitely impacted me. You know, I couldn't shoot the ball like I wanted to the uh, past five weeks. And, you know, I just had to, you know, keep, you know, grinding out the rehab and grinding out the, you know, recovery. You know, eventually I was getting my strength back and getting the, the pain was going away. And so today showed that I was able to shoot the ball like I wanted to and uh, help my team like I wanted to. Three players out for the season with an injury, but then those of you that are in the starting lineup are battling injuries of your own. How would you describe the mentality of this team and the toughness that you've shown here, especially in the later part of the season? Uh, next man up. That's been the mentality of the team since I got to SMU. And so uh, we've been battling, you know, trials since I got to SMU, you know, with stuff you know, happening off the court, you know, injury and stuff like that. And so this year I just told the freshmen, you got to keep battling, you know, college and college basketball that happens, you know, you just got to bounce back next man up and let's get it going. You're a senior and you face the conference regular season champion Cincinnati tomorrow. What is the key for your team to give yourselves a chance in tomorrow's game and to keep making a run in this tournament? Confidence, you know, we just got to go out there and play like we can beat anybody. And, uh, you know, we, if you believe that in your mind, your body will do that. And so I told him today, you got to believe you're going to win. We're not there. We play confident. You know, I think uh, that's the first most up thing we have to do. You know, 
the season didn't go the way we wanted to. So you just got to be confident, you know, anything happened in March. All right, good luck tomorrow. Thank you.